this way because we, we're running out of time and this music is stressful. Oh no. Oh my gosh, why is it speeding up so fast? I feel like I'm in a fever dream. Are you kidding me? Hey guys, Celtic Jolting back in action, and welcome back to Banjo and Kazooie. Who is ready for some desert? Yep, that's right. We didn't finish the desert in the last episode, so uh, we are back in the desert world, and we got to find what uh, left we have to do. Um, I think we got most of the jigsaw pieces for this world, so I'm just gonna kind of look around and see if I got. Oh, oh, it's the hand. It's Grabba. My bad, I forgot about him. <laughs> uh, it's been a little bit since the last Banjo and Kazooie episode, but it usually is, so... Um, I, I, it's not that hard to get used to, trust me. Um, I think there's a flying pad up here, and I think we gotta go through the, like, circle cactuses that look like cock rings. Yeah, we gotta go through those. <laughs> wait a minute! Wait... Wait a minute! Hold... Wait, first of all, you're not gonna speed past that like you didn't just say what you just said. Where's the flying pad? I know it's up here. Oh, I just walked right past it. I swear I didn't see it. I swear. All right, let's take off. Where do we got to go first? Let's go through this one. We do have to go through this, right? I would assume so. Yeah. Summon all the hidden rings of the ancients to beat the witch. Oh, okay. That's pretty straightforward. I don't know how those correlate, but sure. Ah! <laughs> bee almost got me. Who the fuck has ever seen a bee in the desert? Please tell me, because I would like, I would like to find some myself. Do I have to go through this? This looks mad sus. This looks really dangerous. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, I did it. <laughs> what did that do? Uh. Okay. There's one up there. Do I have to like hit that target up there or something? I assume that's probably what I need to do. Oh, no, there's another one over here. Okay. Dope. Maybe then it'll, like, unlock the target or something for me. I just need to get a little lower there, Kazooie. Okay, good. That'll do, bird. That'll do. Is that the last one? Nope, there's a fucking another one. Oh, I'm heading right for it. I fucking knew it. I'm a psychic. All right. Up. Oh, nope. A little bit down. Oh, this is impossible to control. How did we ever do this with a Nintendo 64 controller? Nintendo 64 controllers are the worst controllers in history. <laughs> don't... <laughs> don't even at me. I was a Nintendo 64 kid. Only joking, mortal. We can only give you this. Oh. Well, I didn't think you would directly destroy the witch for me, but thank you. Um... But yeah, I was a Nintendo 64 kid. That was my era. When I was a kid, that's when the Nintendo 64 came out. And I played that junk so much, dude. So, it's not bias, I promise. It's just an awfully wanky controller. Like, why have three, like, grips if you have two hands? That is the most awful design. But they had good games, so I guess I can't, I can't judge it too much. Get away from me, grabba. All right, we gotta get all these um, note pieces as well as all the uh, jigsaw pieces. We can't we can't forget about those. Oh, how many we got? 76. We're almost there, and we got seven out of the ten jigsaws in this world. So um, I think we have to. Uh, we gotta swim under. Oh God. Okay, swimming under. I gotta get these note pieces, guys. I know it's infuriating. Trust me, I'm right there with you. Ooh, ikumbokum. I'm not even gonna try and. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try and call them like mumbo tokens or something, because I I just know somebody's gonna correct me in the comments. Is that all of them? All the note pieces? Oh, hello there. I forgot I was collecting you guys. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> All right, so let's see what's in this temple. I don't know if we've been in this one yet. Maybe I have. Is this the one where we did the... No, we've never been in here. This is King Sandy Butt's tome. Turn back or face his wrath. Um, no. Is this a maze? Yes. You choose not to heed our warning. Prepare to run. Okay. Oh, gold feathers. That's not what I needed, but I'll take them anyway. This way, Kazooie, we're running out of time, and this music is stressful. 
Oh no. Oh my gosh, why is it speeding up so fast? I feel like I'm in a fever dream. Oh, I see it. Wait, but is there a jigsaw in here somewhere or something? I know where the exit is, guys. I know where it's at. I'm just trying to see if there's any extra items to get. No, there is not. Okay. Oh, there's a switch. I gotta hit the switch. Fuck. Go, Kazooie. Go, 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 go. Fuck, wrong way. Damn it, I gotta go all the way around. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Yep. Hey, yes! I knew, I knew that had to be something. I called it in the last step. Oh. Oh my god. Did we just get impaled by like a spiked ceiling? That's my first time dying in this series. You guys have got to commend me for that. <laughs> okay, the maze was super easy, all right? You all saw it. You all saw I made it to the end. I just needed to press the button. That was much more important because it had a jigsaw in it. If I would have noticed it a little bit sooner, that that would have been ideal, but... Uh, choose not to he heed our warning. Prepare to run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not scared of you guys, even though I don't know how to kill you. Oh, we use the golden feathers, right? That's the only way to kill the mummies. Too easy. No, the bear survived. He's after the king's ancient relic. I assume I'm gonna have to fight something. No. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Did y'all hear something whistle? Or was that outside my... No, it was in the headset. It was in the headset. Which one of these have the 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 Jinko in it, right? Yes, it sure is, dude. It's the last one. Yes, awesome. Oh my god, that was so trippy. I thought it was somebody outside my door. I'm like, why are you whistling? <laughs> so that's nine out of the ten. Um, nine out of the ten jigsaws. So. Is the tenth one outside of the world? Or does that count for the same thing? I don't know. Um, where do we go from here? Okay, so we either go in this temple or the one to the right of it. Yeah, so we've been in this temple. We don't need to be in this one anymore. So there was another one over here to the right. Yeah, this one. What's this one all about? Let's find out. Huh. Ten seconds. Oh no, I'll never make it. <laughs> Alright, what's up, guy? Ow! Wait, we did do this one, didn't we? I think we did, but I just want to kill this guy, sorry. Yeah, I think we did do this one. So where else do we have left to go? I think that's everything, right? I don't have all the jigsaw pieces. Uh, okay, so we're missing nine notes. That's no good. We need to find those nine notes, wherever the fuck they are. Ah! Grab a... Fuck out of here, grab a... Might as well grab a pair of these boots so we can move around the map a little faster. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> uh huh. I'm too fast for my own good. Oh, the, yeah, this fucking camel. I forgot about this camel. Okay, we gotta take the magic carpet ride again. Hold up. Yep, yep, yep. Over here. How do I turn these shoes off? I don't want them anymore. Okay, finally. <laughs> the music was driving me mad, dude. Alright, so... I remember moving the camel because... We had to, like... Uh, pile drive his back so he would feed the tree. So now what happens if we hit him? Should I hit him, or should I just talk to him? We should have hit him! Bah, that's it. I'm leaving this desert to find some peace and quiet. That's kind of sad. That we... <laughs> that we just fucking harassed him. Yay, life peace! Not what we needed, though. We need to find those notes and jigsaw pieces, if we can. Oh, shit. We're running out of time. Get up there, Kazumi. 
Whew. Too close to call, Kazooie. Too close to call. Why are there flying pads down there? How do we get to those? Because, I mean, do we push those in or something? Like, why are there flying pads down in the water? That's what I'm confused about. Surely there's some way to drain the water or something, right? Any hours later. All right, so we're back in this crazy fucking maze, and I can't seem to find any of the other notes or any indication on how to get rid of the water. So surely there's nothing in here for me. Uh, but there are, there is the pyramid at the start of the level that I have yet to check this episode. So I'll check that right after this one. Um, did this open before? Yes, it did. Huh. Ow, I landed in the hot quicksand. Ah! Alright, maybe we gotta feed the big guy some more eggs or something. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Let me in. Let me in, buddy. Alright, hold on. We can do this the easy way or the hard way? My nose is all blocked. Oh, yeah, we don't feed him. We fucking unblock his nose or whatever. Uh, excuse me? Sir! Sir, accept the eggs. Thank you. It's not that hard to put eggs up your nose, okay? I've tried it myself. Uh, that cleared Jinxie's nose. Come on in. Yeah, we've been through this song and dance before, Jinxie. I just need to know where the note pieces are. And I guess the last jigsaw is outside of the world, because I can't imagine where else it would be in this, uh, in this level. Oh yeah, we gotta feed the other ones. Oh my god, you guys are so fucking needy. I've never met somebody who likes eggs more than these guys. All right, well, I can look around the room and tell that there's nothing in here either. So I'ma say, fuck those note, uh, note pieces. We're going to the next level. <laughs> I would love to completionist run run this game. Fuck you, Grabba! I would love to completionist run this game, but, I mean, there's only so much time I can waste looking for fucking note pieces. Oh, I'll take those. Thank you. Thank you, bees. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Whew. Heck that level. Ow, you fucking asshole. These bees, dude. That is not... That is not... Many tricks are up my sleeve. To save yourself, you'd better leave. I'm getting sick and tired of being interrupted by that bitch. Alright, alright. Now that they're out of my way, I can get some health that the bee took from me. Oh. What? Why did I go that way? I knew better than to go that way, and I went that way anyways. Alright, where did that jigsaw piece that this thing spit out went? Oh, it's in here. It never spit it out, it just opened the coffin. Duh. Okay, how do I get to that? Do I have to use this jump pad? Fair enough. Come on back around, jump pad. Yeah, got it. All right, all right, we got all 10 jigsaw pieces from that level. Good. No, apparently not. What else is in this level? Uh, Kazooie, you got a little stuck there. <laughs> Did y'all see that? She was just like suspended in midair. Ah, uh, fuck, dude. I can't stand that bee. Hold on, hold on. One second, guys. One second. Come here, you fucking. Yeah! Fuck you! Fuck the bees! I'm just gonna come right out and say it. Fuck the bees. What have the bees ever done for me? Provide health to the world by supplying flowers with pollen? <laughs> I don't need flowers. Ow! Oh my god, I am getting so sick of you, Grabba. Why don't you come back out and say hi? 
why don't you come back out and say hi? Thank you. Thank you. That's all I wanted. Uh, okay, so where do we go from here? I There's got to be a way to drain that water. I just know it. Because there's flying pads down there. Why the hell would... This target! Of course, the fucking target! Why did I not try this before? Hold on, I, got, I gotta get on top of Jinxie real quick. I think I gotta hit the target, and that's gonna lower the water. I think. <laughs> don't, don't quote me on that, but it's our best... It's our best bet for now. Is there a way I can, like... Like, drill it or something? Let's see. Oh! That didn't look right. Let's try that again. There's gotta be a way I can, like, shoot eggs out while I'm flying or something like that. Right? Like, you would think so. Because I have to hit this target. How would I do that? I am so confused. Alright, I gotta look something up. <laughs> I just learned something. <laughs> Extremely important. Um, I can attack in the air. So I was right about that. However, <laughs> it's a move I learned in another world. So, uh, oops. <laughs> I have to go to Freezy Peak. Uh, to learn that move and then we can come back to this world and then we can get the jigsaw and Yeah, hopefully the other nine note pieces as well I still got that other world where I got to get the other note pieces So maybe we'll do like an extra episode after we end the series uh, Just going back and collecting everything I didn't get before um, That sounds like a good idea, but for now I have to journey across half the fucking map just to get to freezy peak So I will be right back all right, you guys remember when we were in the swamp area and um, we went behind the bog and like into this like frost region? Um, that's where we gotta go. Uh, and hopefully we'll have enough note pieces to fill that up and go there. Ah, shit, I need the boots. Hold on. Ken's, uh, sorry, I didn't see what she said. I'm not even gonna try and read it now. <laughs> you guys saw it. You guys can read, hopefully. If you're watching this... Uh, video and you don't know how to read you're probably not old enough to be watching this video <laughs> all right hopefully this this will last us long enough to walk across the water it usually doesn't last us long enough in other circumstances so I'm a little worried for that but so uh, while we're making this um, while we're making this trek through the swamp lands I got some information to tell you guys I'm engaged <laughs> My, um, a lot of you have probably already seen this on my Instagram and, uh, Facebook and Twitter or whatever, but my girlfriend, uh, proposed to me, uh, about a week ago, and we're going to Colorado to, um, uh, have our own wedding in about a week. It's not gonna be- Oh, fuck, dude. How do I break this? Oh, like that. <laughs> I shouldn't be allowed to play video games. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I'm too small for this. Do I have to be the alligator? Oh, son of a bitch. So now, okay, all right. Let me get this straight. Oh, hold on, let me get my boots first. Let me get this straight. To get a jigsaw piece in the desert world, I have to go back to the swamp world to turn into a crocodile to go back to the frost world to go through the boulder that I had to break when I wasn't a crocodile when I come back from the desert war. That's a mouthful. <laughs> I thought progress was more straightforward than this, Banjo-Kazooie. You're making me do way too much work for this. Ow, my ass. Do you think the fish bite us when we go into the water because Kazooie ch uh, tastes like chicken? That's probably why. It, that's my head cannon now. Isn't this music just wonderful? I love this world. This is my favorite world. I know I've mentioned that before, but it's my favorite world. Like, why would you not like a world where you can turn into a crocodile and fight another crocodile? Like, that is the coolest shit. Well, we weren't technically fighting, but you know, you know what I mean. 
Man, coming back to this maze after doing the maze in the desert world is such a relief. <laughs> the maze in the desert world was... It wasn't bad, it was just the fucking... It was just the fact that the button was so far away from the exit, you know? Like, I had to lose a life just to press the button. That's a little sus. Alright, Mumbo. I got all these tokens. You better turn me into a fucking crocodile. Yes! I'm, a part of me is real glad we had to go back to this world to uh, turn back into the crocodile. Because cause I, I missed it. This is... Uh, Every time I've played Banjo and Kazooie before this series, like I've revisited it, I only played up into the this world and then I stopped playing because the other worlds are cool and all. It's just I had the most nostalgia for this one. Can I get out through here? No, I can't. I gotta go through this way. Cool. But yeah, I had the most nostalgia in this world because when I was a kid, I would like try to look in every single little corner for secrets. Because I thought Nintendo games were that advanced when in reality they wasn't. But um, after I'd complete the world, I would just roam around and collect all the eggs and the feathers and try to find some Easter eggs and shit. Because this is this is by far the coolest level. IMO. You wanna get your shit rocked? Yeah! That's what I fucking thought. Go back to your stump, you little bitch! Alright, back... To the ice world. Uh, I'm a little worried though. How are we gonna get back if we can't fit through the hole? Right? Like I am a crocodile, but that only lasts for like a little bit before I have to turn back into Banjo and Kazooie. So am I gonna get stuck on the other side? Or do we just go straight into the world? I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember a lot about this world. I think you have to like snowboard and race against like a polar bear or some shit. So that's pretty cool. Whoa. What the fuck? Cheeto, the spell book you have found. Magic cheats I have for you. Hey, book brain, what did you say? You better not give my uh, spells away. Which lost book? Finders, bears, and birds are spells they get uh okay come on book boy give us the spells only one spell cheeto can tell enter the code blue eggs on sandcastle floor in the treasure trove cove world help you it will hidden in lair other spell books are them you should find okay Code is blue eggs. Enter code and sank also the floor. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. So, I guess we'll go do that. I mean, I don't really want cheats, but I want to see what it is, you know? So, we'll do that before we end the episode. Um, j I'm running out of time, but we haven't had much uh, screen time for this episode. So, I'll go, I'll go to the treasure trove world and type in the cheat code. How bright they are, your stupid shorts. <laughs> a target for my dumb cohorts. A, oh, my blue shorts. Uh, or my, my um, like, neon yellow shorts. Yeah. It probably looks like a bullseye on my back. Mumbo magic, get weak. Yeah, I'd imagine it would. Uh, magic, run out. Okay, that's fine. I don't need your magic. Alright, so, where is the... Sand world. Is that down here? Or Treasure Trove Cove? That's down here, right? I think so, yeah. Ah, oh, man, what a blast of the past. This was like second episode shit, wasn't it? What episode are we on now? I, I, I couldn't tell you. <laughs> You'd think I'd know, considering that uh, they're my videos, but, you know, you gotta realize I upload four videos a week, pretty much, so... They kind of get lost in time a little bit. Ah, oh, shit. We got to get rid of the water. Uh, I remember how to do that. Hold on. We got to go up to this bucket and poop in it. Get off of me, you fucking crab. <laughs> I feel like I just used a slur, but he was actually just a crab. If crab is offen uh, offensive in your language, please let me know in the comments, because that would be funny as fuck. <laughs>
Me leaky, no good for water. Yep, we know. Can bear block hole with pebble? Uh, no pebble, but I got egg. Yeah, poop it right in there for you. Leaky patched up. Now empty water for bear. That makes no sense. That is the dumbest video game logic. Okay. We gotta go in and show this crab who's boss again. What's up, bro? Long time no see. Straight to action. A man after my own heart. Oh, we only get one health from him. Okay, what do we gotta put in? Blue eggs? Okay. Let me do that real quick. I wonder what cheat this gives me. I wonder if this gives me, like, infinite eggs or something. Um, I don't know if it's an actual cheat, like, that'll make the game, like, super OP. Or if it's just something that's gonna help me because I found an Easter egg. Um. Uh, e. G. G. And then S. Where's an S? Right here. I was right on it. But. 200 eggs are now yours. Now 200 is maximum too. Wow. Uh, that lousy cheat for extra eggs won't help bear and chicken legs. That's actually very helpful. What about red feathers? Did I do that? No, I can't do it. Dang. Oh, well, at least we have extra eggs now. It's not too helpful because I hardly use my eggs anyway, but um, that's cool. Now I have a max. I don't have to stockpile them or anything. Uh, I know the eggs are super important for the boss, uh, the final boss of the game, which is obviously grunty. So that is kind of helpful. I'm glad I found that. But that is all the time we have for Banjo and Kazooie today. If you enjoy this series, leave a like down below and comment if you have any other game suggestions. And don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. It's free. You might as well. And if you enjoy my content, don't forget to hit that bell so you'll be notified whenever new episodes come out. But thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you, as always, in the next video. Bye.